and we're back to learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to create a watercolor text effect. Some of the inbuilt filters in Inkscape are better suited for text than images, for example the watercolor filter. Let me create some text with the type 2 and a size set up, holding Ctrl and Shift. It's selected, I press Ctrl D to create two copies. Let me select the top one, I go to filters, textures and watercolor. So it's a one click effect. If you want to adjust it, there are two ways. So I copy the one below, I've got two. On top, I apply the watercolor filter to the first one, put it to the bottom, and then I open the fill and stroke menu. I've got the one selected that doesn't have the watercolor filter, and I can now play around with the opacity and the blur. That's one way that you can adjust it slightly. Another way is to use yet another filter. So add the watercolor. And then go to filters, image effects, and use the sharpen and sharpen more. Sounds counterintuitive as it's an image effect, but it works on text. And as you can see, you can intensify the letters by doing that. Keep in mind, whenever you move it, the uh, sharpen filter will be reapplied and it changes the appearance a little bit. And when you want to export the one in the middle, don't forget to select both of these bounding boxes, otherwise you're only going to select the one that is blurred and a little bit opaque. So don't forget that. And this is how I can create a watercolor text effect in Inkscape. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.